Hey, yo, what's good, man? It's your boy Derek Branch here at Strike7Sports.com. Today, I just want to talk about, uh, you know, the recent news concerning, uh, well, former Saints head coach Sean Payton uh, finally stepping away from uh, 16 years of service, I believe, 16 years of coaching, black and gold, um, Super Bowl championship, NFC division titles, NFC South division titles, multiple NFC uh Conference, uh, conference uh, championship game appearances, uh, multiple 13 win seasons. He's uh, walking away from uh, coaching, and you know, y'all may know or not, uh, may know or not that uh, I follow the Saints. It's my team that I uh, followed throughout the years. These last couple of years, well, he's, well, for, for, for how many? But um, to talk around, that's been talking around uh, about Peyton possibly joining. Dallas Cowboys after the 2022 season if uh, things don't go right for Mike McCarthy in uh, Dallas. And a lot of people, you know, hear a lot of people saying, you know, you know, in the same circles that uh, Peyton will never join the Jerry Jones and the Cowboys because of uh, Jerry Jones' uh, you know, tendencies as an NFL owner, the way he operates and how he has to have his uh, stamp on everything, his hands, into everything of, the, of every fuss of the team. I'll just come here with, I'll just say this, man. I just Here's a takeaway from, from, what, from what I see. If you do decide to pursue Peyton, you have to give up to the Saints some uh, compensation because uh, Peyton's still in the contract. However, I will say this, though. I think with, you know, Sean Peyton's uh, cachet, swagger, resume as a head coach, his uh, ability to turn around quarterbacks. I think uh, Jerry might bag back, man. He might ease up on the ball. He just might. I think Sean Payne is that good. You know, you saw what he did with a, uh, with a roster. The roster he had this season. The team was 9-8. Almost made the playoffs. Um, just kept them competitive. Despite the challenges they had on offense. So, I think that's a chance Jerry Jones might ease up on the power. Him and his son. If Peyton, if he, if he had a chance to, um, to lure Peyton. I'm just saying. You know, it's a very chance. It's a very high possibility that happen. You know. I remember, I'm not really saying really about the Saints, you know, with their head coach. But I think they'll be fine once we find the right guy. But, it's about the Cowboys. And, if, you know, Mike McCarty is most likely going to be on the hot seat. You know. Um, he has to uh, pretty much exceed the playoffs to keep that job, you know. But what Peyton will be inheriting in uh, Dallas will be a Super Bowl contending roster, man. Um, we got Dak. Um, I'm assuming the Mark Cooper will be back, um, in spite of what, uh, in spite of what Jones said about his contract. He didn't know he was upset about it. Running game may get it upgraded. Who knows? Still got a uh, CD Lamb. Uh, Don't show the tight end. He's pretty good. Defense is legit. Still playing those guys on defense. Uh, you just got to, you might need, you might need to do a different voice. Who knows, man? But Mike McCarthy, man, who I, it depends on how Mike McCarthy takes this. Might take this as motivation and it might coach better in 2022. Who knows, man? But we'll see. All right, man, that's all I have for y'all for right now, man. Give me a like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Let me know how y'all feel. Do you think Peyton will be coaching the Cowboys in 2023? Also, do you think Jerry Jones might uh, might uh, ease up on the power control in Dallas if Peyton becomes a head coach? Um, also, check out strikes for the content on NFL, the NBA, and much more. Have a blessed day. Peace, I'm out.